Hi and welcome. In this video, I'm going to check out the Wall Street Journal on Daydream VR. My name is Sebastian and this is for Daydream District bringing you the latest news and reviews about the Daydream VR platform. So before I had already checked out the CNN VR app, which was really cool with lots of VR videos and the latest news. Let's see what the Wall Street Journal has to offer. Location-wise, it's not as futuristic as the CNN app, and that's fine. We are in some very nice upscale apartment in New York City. Let's have a look at this information here. And okay, here are the privacy, terms and conditions, and the credits. Let's have a look at the main menu here. Here we have VR videos on the left, latest news, and then normal videos. And what's really interesting about this app is here on the bottom, which is some kind of stock chart, a three-dimensional stock chart, where you can see the different stocks divided by their industry. And you can see if they're going up and down in 3D, really, really cool. So like this, you can directly see the winner and loser of each industry or overall who is the biggest winner of this day. This is very, very well done, I have to say. It's a very good idea from the Wall Street Journal. Let's play around just a little bit more with this. <laughs> this is really good. And then now let's have a look at a VR video. So here we have a selection of videos. Let's just choose one, probably this, and let's have a look. Yeah, so this is some Wall Street Journal content. In this video, we see some doves flying around in 360 degrees. First impression is that the resolution doesn't seem to be so high. But this, of course, could be because my internet connection probably is not fast enough. I'm not sure. But I think this will get better over time. Oh, this is cool. Yeah, just like with most of those 360 videos, it's a really, really nice experience. Much better than just looking at 360 photos, of course. It really puts you into the middle of the action. Really cool on the periphery as they kind of wander through their busy daily life that they don't really spend that much time looking at them. All right, enough of this. You can check it out yourself once you download the app because it's free. Okay, that was the wrong button. Now I'm back to the menu. Let's go back to the Wall Street Journal. And here we are again. Let's have a look at the latest news. So let's click on Facebook, on this Facebook news article. And the article is coming up in front of you. Or it should, here it is. And you can read it and scroll through it by swiping on your touchpad of the motion controller. Okay, now let's check the 2D videos. This should be simple 2D videos. And if you click on them, the screen will appear in front of you and you can simply watch the normal 2D videos on that screen in front of you. A line, natural ally in that regard with the Russians, with the Iranians, with many other countries who wanted to defeat the terrorists. I'm looking at Assad and saying maybe he's better than the kind of people. Yeah, and that's it for the walkthrough of the Wall Street Journal app for Daydream VR. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, click on subscribe to never miss any Daydream District video in the future.